My name is Stefan uh, Terrier, and uh, I have two restaurants here in San Francisco, uh, Per Bacco and Bar Bacco. Uh, Italian food, so. One of the dishes that I'm gonna be making is a, a wild mushroom risotto, being very, of course, very Italian. Uh, well, the, the risotto will be cooked on the stove very slowly, uh, you know, like rice is cooked, but uh, in that I'm gonna incorporate uh, red miso, sake, uh, both that uh, have rice in them and also our Japanese ingredients, uh, which will, you know, enhance the flavor uh, in a very different way of risotto. And uh, fi finalized with the, uh, with the miso and uh, butter and uh, Parmesan cheese. And, uh, miso to me is almost like a universal flavor enhancer to bring you know, do umami in anything you do. It's kind of like Parmesan cheese is used in Italy. It heightens the flavor of a lot of dishes. So in itself, it's so complex uh, that it, it works in a very wide spectrum. So, And the second dish will be miso and milk braised pork. Uh, together with uh, also again some black garlic uh, from the uh, Aomori prefecture in Japan. The garlic is a lot sweeter than raw garlic uh, and um, it just brings more of a gentle garlic flavor to the dish and the braised pork will be simmering slowly all together so then served over poletta. Um, I love the, both of the dishes, the flavors were very, very good. I had never tasted uh, something with sake, and I believe that the sake helped a lot the flavors to bring out the flavors of both of the dishes. I believe it's very, very good. Um, I love the mushrooms, the different kinds of mushrooms he used. Um, they're amazing, and the taste of I was fascinated by, by the black garlic. I didn't know that that existed, and I'm very curious about um, Trying to find out how can we use it and how it tastes, why 